I can sing. They don't know that yet, though. Hey, yeah. Yeah, it runs in the blood. <laughs> Only thing that runs in my blood is me. <laughs> Speaking of running, I haven't been able to run because I got my tattoo and shit. Yeah, because they can see that real quick after that. They really didn't see the finish of it. Ooh, they didn't get a pump yet. Let's relax. All right, guys, what's going on? M3 Kobe, part of the M3 Lifestyle. Today, we're going to be training at my college gym. I am currently graduating, so I figured, hey, why not finish off with a fucking bang? Let's go ahead and finish off right. Um, this is probably be the last time the gym sees me on a consistent basis. I don't really come here too often. I mean, it's just because the gym is like kind of ass. But I was like, you know what? Let me just pull up here one time for just for, for content purposes. And for people that say they got limited equipment. So you guys get a chance to see me train over here at FAU and get a pretty good lift in. I'm training back and biceps today, by the way. So people in here always look at me like I'm awesome shit because I'm like the biggest guy that walks in here. Jonah, you're probably the second biggest guy. Oh, I didn't even tell you. I walked out here the other day, and they they try to offer me like a preferred walk-on spot on the football team. Crazy. For real? <laughs> yeah. They were like, "You play?" I was like, "I know how to." They were like, "We gotta find somebody to talk to." I said, "I'm kind of in a rush right now." They were like, "We gotta find somebody to talk to you right now." Then I'm like, "Okay." Hey, it is what it is. What was I? I was at the library getting my graduation stuff situated, and then I had came here to ask them like, "Hey, is it cool if I have a camera guy?" And also, how does the guest thing work if I have a camera guy? They're like, oh, he has to pay $10 to get in. It's all good. So they said you just got to fill out a, the document. So like, if you guys didn't know, I'm graduating. People keep asking me, like, what am I doing with my degree? I feel like I'm already doing it, you know? The purpose of me being in school was to, like, I've told you before, but to establish a skill set rather than focus on a sheet of paper. Like, a lot of people do that. They focus on the destination without learning to love the journey. Somebody who loves to walk or loves to run will always beat somebody who loves the destination more. This is how it is. So when it comes to what I plan on doing with my degree, I'm already doing it, all right? Um, a lot of the things that I implement into content as well as the way I post on social media, the, the way I even speak, or when I meet individuals in person, a lot of it comes from my degree. My degree is in communication studies. A lot of people are like, oh, that's an easy degree, you know, to get. You know, of course you can say that, but at the same time, a lot of you guys have social anxiety. You can't even speak in front of a crowd, let alone talk in front of a camera without, you know, stuttering or saying filler words or things of that nature. So I feel like a lot of things only come into hand when you learn how to implement it. Knowledge is only powerful if you learn how to apply it. So take that however you want, take it with a grain of salt, and hopefully I'll use that information to the best of your ability. If you are somebody who's in school, or think about going to school, have an actual purpose for why you're there, rather than just looking for the end game. Because I'm sorry to break it to you, you go apply for that job, there's a thousand other people who apply for that job with a degree, all right? That's what gets your foot in the door. What keeps you in the door is what well, all is up here or wherever else, what other assets you may hold. Sorry for the rant. <laughs> that are currently in college who think that they have like no access to train 
You have plenty, bro. You gotta learn how to use it. All you need for, like, for example, for a pull day is a roll movement, maybe a pull down movement, a deadlift movement. That's really it right there. <laughs> and then some biceps, which is like curls. You can do that shit from your crib if you really got enough equipment. But a college gym got plenty, bro. Especially if y'all membership is free. I better use that shit. Make sure you're on the side. It's gonna be better than the first thing we yesterday. Push it tomorrow, thank you.